we we la- oh and by the way Jericho now you got to admit he heard us he heard us he went on a diet he's cut the carbs he's lost some weight he's got a nice fake tan he's colored his hair he's looking better physically whose hair uh Jericho's hair he's colored it whose hair right? is it well i it's, he bought it i don't know who it, he bought it from but it, he owns it cuz he paid for it but now he's also picked up three new stooges. He, this whole group around him is meant to just be a spotlight for him because I'm sure he's told these guys he's going to get them over. And they're happy because now they've got a spot. But it's going to be that they get the shit kicked out of them and so that he, if people don't kick the shit out of him, and he's it, basically it's Mo, Larry, and Curly with... Jake Hager, the nasty wabbit, and the Jericho Appreciation Society is are these main event fellows, and they didn't try to make them main event fellows before they put them in this thing. They brought them in out of nowhere. They put them on every television. They have not won a fucking match. They've been beaten by everybody in the company. I'm sure they won something on YouTube. I'm talking about in the real world. I love these fucking, they continue, the AEW fans continue to say, well, you have to watch the YouTube and the dark and the elevation and the this and that. No. If it ain't on fucking national goddamn cable television, it must not be important. I got a limited amount of time. So they everybody in the company beats them, and then Jericho brings them in to change their name and make stooges out of them so that everybody can beat them instead of him. And there's Magic Mike and fucking Daddy Luke and... Cool Whip Parker and that one guy I, though, Magic Mike or, or whatever his fucking name is, the one with the big head. He's got personality. Yes, I don't know yes, what he he's does. saying or what he's talking about, but he's got personality. Daniel Garcia, if he didn't open his mouth, he could look a little intimidating because he looks like the, <laughs> you know, like, like I said, like a soccer hooligan. He looks like a fucking yeah. classic skinhead out of uh, you know the fucking ska movement. I'm not saying a skinhead in terms of being a Nazi or anything, but like he just has a look. You could see him starting a fight in a bar. Until he opens his mouth. And then it's like, oh boy. Whatever he's reciting, don't do that again. And I'm already getting sick of all Jericho's catchphrases. Well, they're trademarked, though. That's um, not entertainment, Chris. But it, That's well, we'll, not entertainment. 